Hello everyone. Today I'll be reviewing my talking Disney Store Zerg, released by Disney Store in 2012 or 13 by Disney Store. Or mine is the 2018 reissue with the updated box. So let's get into the review. I'll show this box first. Here's this box looks like. It's try me. It's a like, evil one for Zerg. Arch enemy of Buzz Lightyear. Or 12 phrases. Plus the 12 phrases. Just like in Toy Story 2. Like that box. Like the box you see in Toy Story 2. There's a whole look at the top. Side view. It's fully articulated neck, waist, and arms. Sun cut satari et sis bra sun turn articulus. Yeah, it's the multi-language translation on it. Other side. Mouth mouth eyes or mouth and eyes light up when talking. Some bush it tisis yes I didn't quite do it. Power back of the box. Hold on real close so you can see it. So we're watching Buzz Lightyear, Disney Pixar. Press button to spin balls and language translation. I thought he's live when talking. Fully articulate neck, waist, and arms. Over 12 phrases. Like Buzz Lightyear's box, we got a little description on the back, just like Buzz did in Zerg's picture. I'm sorry, this is a little torn up, but this is a little damaged when I first got him. It's like mortals. Goes, Behold the awesome figure of Evil and Berserk. I'm called the Scrooge of the Demon Quadrant. Sworn, sworn destroyer of the Galactic Alliance. And the arch nemesis of that cursed space ranger, Buzz Lightyear. My little minions have constructed a weapon of mass destruction so powerful that soon the online and galaxy shall know the name. Name Zerg. More multi language translation. So you put the batteries. It takes three. You need AAA batteries. Toy Story. Oh, sorry. And bombs. A bunch of multi language translation. And that's his box. That's look great. They did a good job on the redesign box in 2018. I mean, before you had an open box and you saw it at Disney Store or Disney Parks, but I think this looks like the definitive version. You know, there's no red clear plastic window like in Toy Story 2 on here. Let's get into Zerg himself. And here we have Zerg himself. He looks really nice. He's one of the best movie accurate full scale Zergs we've ever gotten released. I think we've always never released anything Mattel or Hasbro. They don't really waste any of that stuff. They always just smaller action figures of Zerg. Yeah, but Disney Store, this is like the definitive version that Disney Store gave us. So let's measure him. Zerg approximately measures almost 15 and a half inches tall from his the bottom of him to his horns. Let's take a look at Zerg himself. He looks really nice. He has a nice dark purple colored one. He's a very nice Zerg figure overall. He also has his, his, his cape as well. Just the back view. It's a flexible plastic. It's very nice. So there's his ammo in the back. Hmm. Unfortunately, look, he doesn't have the red hole like in the back of his head, like in Toy Story 2 for you know Zerg vision. Hmm. His face sculpt looks very really nice. Hmm. His mommy has the wheels. He spin the front rotates so he can change his direction. He has some printing on the bottom. Disney Store Limited, 3 Queen Caroline Street, London. Yeah. This is where he changed the ba battery department, where he changed the batteries. It takes three AAA batteries. Articulation. He can, his waist rotates. The arms move up and down. The elbows bend. The wrists rotate. His left hand is movable fingers, but the next one moves it. Can be pried apart individually. The head doesn't move a lot. I mean, it does have some articulation. You can't really tear much to the electronics in there. But also, with the wheels, it does allow them to move around. Just like in Toy Story 2, which is nice. Just because, like, well, you can see that. You can, that's where his speaker is. His waist cannot be turned 360 to the speaker in there, and the, the battery's doing the bottom. Is, the bottom fin. So that's where the speaker's located. So you can't really 360 turn into the electronics. You guys, I am blaster. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Fortunately, the dial does not turn. 
so that there's no dowel or sticker detailing on this side. Sound blaster. Obviously, he does not shoot Nerf balls like in Toy Story 2. This is also a flexible plastic material. In the back, you, of course, in the back, you can press this button and his ammo rotates. His ammo balls rotate. In his backpack, he has. He has very nice articulation in his hands, so like you can hold the ion blaster. Or in, well, his arm doesn't. Sorry. So you can't hold the ion blaster. His joints are tight, which is nice, so you can hold up the ion blaster and he doesn't, his arm doesn't droop or anything. That's very nice. Okay. Now I think we'll go into his talking feature. The box is speaks for 12 phrases. So he's, the rest of the chest patch is eyes, mouth, and chest patch live when he talks. Now, I don't believe this, I don't think this guy ha has Andrew Stanton's original, sorry. I don't believe he has Andrew Stanton's original voice from Toy Story 2. I don't know how many people voice Serg. Other, so, you know, let's, let's press chest badge and listen to the 12 phrases and sounds he says. That's all the phrases he says. The audio is real nice and loud and clear, which I like. I'm gonna show you what it looks like in the dark. You're like, really just get the lights. That's all he says. Also, one thing you can do is well, you can press this chest button while he's talking and skip to other phrases. Watch. So it's kind of like my ultimate Space Ranger Buzz Lightyear Deluxe figure made by, made by Mattel released in 2009. Or any other toy like that, where you can press the buttons while they're they're talking and skip to other phrases. We can Zerg overall. Let's do a size comparison real quick. And for size comparison, here's Toy Story Collection and Toy Belt Buzz for a size comparison. I think the scaling looks really nice. And Buzz is 12 inches tall. Zerg's like almost like 15 inches tall. Yeah. So the scaling is, is fits really well. I like Zerg to have. Your collection. He's a really good Zerg overall. I recommend him for your Toy Story collection. This guy was released back in 2012 or 13, 2012 or 2013. One of the sets he originally came in was a two pack from the, from the, sorry, one of the sets he originally came in was in a two pack from the Disney Store. He also came with the Disney Store Advanced Buzz Lightyear that was exclusive to the set. His color scheme was like a yellow, a yellow. I think it's like a young green or a yellow green, and also his gray was his white was gray. And here's what the set looks like. Interesting thing about the set is that I mean, Zerg is still the same same phrases, but Buzz actually has some different phrases than compared to, to a normal Disney Store Advanced Buzz Lightyear. And they actually interact. Well, they don't technically interact, but they have synced voices. Like Zerg has the same phrases. Buzz actually has 
phrases that are his responses deserve. So they're kind of synced. Here's what they here's what they are or what they sound like. Like if you get the the phrases right, the timing of them. I am Buzz Lightyear. I protect the galaxy from the threat of invasion from the evil Emperor Zerg. So we meet again, Buzz Lightyear. For the last time. That's what they say. Then 2019 for Toy Story 4 at Walmart, they had this really crappy set. It was like the original Disney Store Buzz's or two pack set, but it was like a, it was kind of like a bootleg. It was a stripped down version of the original ones. Here's what it looks like. I saw it at my Walmart, one of the Walmarts in 2019. That's what the set looks like. One, one thing I do not like about it is that Disney Store, or Buzz is like a stripped down version of the Disney Store Advanced Buzz Lightyear. Well, he's telling the, the J.C. Payne version, the English-Spanish version, but he doesn't have the grim facial expression. Stripped down things about him are he does not have the purple and the purple color on his fingertips or his thumbs. Also, one thing is his wingtip lights and jack sauce lights, lights do not work at all. His voice sounds a bit low, like the batteries are dying. I'm not sure if that's how it is or I don't know. And Zerg really sucks too because because when he presses chest badge, his eyes, mouth, and chest badge do not light up. Here, let me show you what it looks like. So that's what it looks like. I mean, I have, if you get Dizzy Store Zerg, I highly don't recommend that set. You are getting scammed, scammed for that set. Like it's a complete rip off. You're getting ripped off for that set. It's a huge waste of your money to get a. Disney Store Zerg, it doesn't light up. So I highly recommend you don't buy that set. Disney Store also made the, in 2020, last, in 2020, they made a Toy Story 4 toy detector Zerg. It's like this Zerg I have, except he, right here, uh, he had an infrared transmitter and receiver. On the side here, he would have the, the try me or solo mode off and interactive mode switch. Here's what he looks like. The box is the same, so you got the toy checker thing on the front there. And I also don't, I don't really like the phrases because he doesn't say, I'm your father. So, or, so we meet again, Buzz Lightyear, for the last time. Unfortunately, he does not say those phrases. I mean, here's what they look like, or what, you know, or what he says. Come to me, my friend. <laughs> Come 
So that's why he says, I think for the original one over the Toy Tector one. And by the way, this guy, Toy Tector is with Buzz, so he can unlock, they can each can unlock two new phrases. And here's what they are. Oh, if, if you already got the Buzz when he came out the Toy Tector one from the Z store, he, he's not going to lock anything new with Zerg, because I think if you want it to work, yeah, Buzz has to be the updated version. If you had the original one, it's, he's not going to lock anything new, or he's not going to, they're not going to have any long conversations or or talk back and forth a bunch. So here's what they are. So that's what they unlock. It's a, yeah, honestly, compared to those, I prefer this one. Because Toy Tector is just, yeah, it's not like good. If you want to see Sword Zerg, I just highly recommend the original over Toy Tector. Also, one problem is, is probably complaints would be that not only does he not shoot nerve balls out, but if, in the movie, is, the lights in his mouth are supposed to be in the middle, they're supposed to move down to the sides. But, There's, a, there's actually a video on YouTube of um, someone modded their Disney Store Zerg to make made the, made him have multiple LED lights in his mouth that start in the middle, move down to the sides. So here I'll show you. So I'm going to look at Zerg. I got him as a Christmas present in 2018 along with Disney Store Galloping Bullseye 2018 reissue and Disney Store Pizza No. 5 plush. So if you to Zerg today, I mean, you can find a Disney Store, but it's mostly going to be a toy detector. Hmm. If you want the, the original non-toy detector one, I think he, he may or may not be on Amazon. Or if not, you can search for, search for him on eBay. You can, Zerg, you can also find in the two-pack, the non-toy detector one with the, that Exclusive version of Disney Store Fancy Clothes Lighter with different color schemes and different phrases. Mm. Yeah. But just, I highly advise you do not buy the two pack, the, the yellow, blue, and white one. I advise you don't buy that one, the one that's like a knockoff, because you're getting scammed for not getting a Zerg that doesn't have I have eyes, my eyes, mouth, or a chest badge. So I highly re re don't recommend that set. You're getting ripped off for that set. It's like a bootleg of the original Disney Store Buzz Zerg 2 pack. Yeah, we hope you enjoyed this review, and I'm I'm excited to see what how Zerg is how Zerg looks and how he's going to be in how he's going to be in Toy Story or no Lightyear. So I'm hyped how how Zerg is going to looks and how he's going to be in in Lightyear when he comes out in summer. If I ever do get my hands on the, the new Mattel Zerg action figures, the smaller ones and the, the larger sized ones, then I might do, I'll do a review a comparison with my, my Disney Store Zerg. If you enjoyed this review, make sure to like this video if you enjoy it, and subscribe to the channel for more upcoming content, and comment below in the comment section. I'll see you next, all next time. Have a great day.